My name was Edward Jepton, but they call me Ned. I, I grew up in St. Mary's, and we, when I grew up there, we had our own schooner. And when I was old enough, I was fishing in Harlem. But the fish we failed after, so my brothers, we gave, gave it up then. The price was no good. Well, it was mostly uh, your own homemade bread and your own vegetables that you grew, and different kinds of fish. You had dry fish, fresh fish. You didn't have much fresh fish, only in the summer, because we didn't have no power down here. So you couldn't keep fresh fish. And you had cape and herring, any, any fish, mackerel, but it was mostly in the summer. In the winter, mostly dry fish. Well, you had to, uh, well, you said, we get the fish first, and then split it and salt it, and then you wash it out, and you put it in a bulk. You call it, we call that water horse, and then you spread it and make it. And uh, it had to be made good then to get a better price for it. So. And that, that was it with the dry, with the fish. It was a lot of work though. If the weather was bad, then that wasn't good. I should have to leave it in and spread it when it'd be fine. Oh yeah, we had cows. I, I, was, I was into myself a bit there. Uh, up to, when I was 80, I gave them up. And uh, I had, uh, I had uh, well, I had eight one year, I used to have, we used to sell the calves for veal, but if you had a good, good calf, a nice half of it for me to keep them. The bull calves just sold them. No, well, yeah, you had a few hens, but you always had to keep a horse because you didn't, we didn't have any tractors. Well, you had to haul the wood with him, you had to do the plowing, and you had to get, get the cape for the gardens. Or oh, he couldn't live without a horse. He, he did a lot of work. But uh, you grew and then, then you had, we had no equipment, but you had a horse and plow. And that's how you sucked your vegetables. And you put a, we used a lot of steam manure and stuff, clear turnip. We used kelp. And the, the older people used a lot of kelp. And uh, uh, gave up, stay, I don't, years ago to give up on stable manure for turnips. They used to get brown heart in the turnip. And they weren't nice. So the kelp was good for that. We didn't have no fertilizer of any kind. So. Just camp and stay up here. Well, we used to go up in the door and cut it off the rocks. But now, I get to the home now, if there's a sea in the winter, the, troll, go, the sea takes it in, and you can go down and pick it up. We're home now that way. But we used to have to go up before in the door again, because you'll be looking for it in the spring of the year. Well, my father used to hunt a good bit uh, and when he was young, when he got married. But they used to be after the otters and beavers and stuff. There was no moose, they only had a few years ago. And the rabbits and parrots. There was parrots. There was fun of parrots. I remember stepping up there. They're scarce now, they're gone. Or just about it. I don't know what happened to them. Maybe coyotes eating eggs or something, I don't know. They've just set the traps for the beavers, put the rest of them, and the otters, dead nets for them. You just put it in the river, put trout in, and the otters would go into the net. The beavers, they used to, some people used to eat them. They were, they were good. I suppose they wouldn't eat them today, but. 